Hi everybody, it's Heather and I am out here at the Tooth Draw Quarry near Newell, South Dakota. I started out here yesterday on a dig with Paleo Adventures and Walter Stein. And yesterday I was digging down into this wall right here. This is part of the Hell Creek Formation. It is late Cretaceous, about 65 million years old and it was terrestrial environment, so we are out here looking primarily for dinosaur bones. Triceratops, Edmontosaurus, and Tyrannosaurus have been, all been found here. So yesterday when I was digging through all this, I was digging down to the sand and I hit something really hard and it turned out to be a small piece of turtle shell. Walter told me that it was probably going to be something I could keep so long as it was no bigger than six inches. If it was bigger than six inches, that it was going to be scientific material. Well, it got to be more than six inches in about five minutes. And then it got to be about eight inches. And then it got to be a whole lot bigger. So, meet. Bingo the turtle. This was a land tortoise. This is all the edge of the shell right here. It goes all the way around. I am still digging it out. I've been spending the morning digging out the rest of it. I left it off last night and came back. And you can see right here, the shell is still going under the wall. And it curves down through here. And it's gonna come through and it comes down and down, around curves down into the matrix this way. And then this morning, I said, oh dang, because there's an Edmontosaurus tendon that runs underneath the shell, which is probably, may or may not be recoverable because we have to jacket the shell. And there's something else right here, it might be another piece of turtle shell underneath the clay. So I've got to excavate this really carefully today. So stay tuned. We and here on? we have Walter Stein using the hammer and chisel two days after we said we were going to do nothing but delicate work with nothing harder than a trowel because the mountain had other ideas. Well, what I said was we don't allow guests <laughs> Me, on the other hand, I'm using hammers and trowels and uh, chisels quite a bit. All right, so we got the iron, iron stone out of here. And this turtle just keeps getting bigger and bigger. I'm trying to keep my shadow out of this. When we started out just this little section right here was what the first bit we found. And now, going all the way around, down into here, looks like maybe into here. There's another little bit of bone right here that may or may not be part of it. And we're starting to see stuff over here. There's a little bit of bone. And there in the center is a little bit of bone. And goodness knows where we're going to go. So it is the end of day three. We've probably got about half an hour left in our digging day, and this is still not completely uncovered. This section right here was all done this afternoon after we got that clay boulder out. But you can see it's still going in the rock under here. And I was running into problems because this part right here is starting to get really crumbly and the rock is getting really, really hard. So I actually stopped here to let somebody with more practiced hands finish the excavation. I'm really disappointed that I don't get to see this whole thing come out of the wall today. But hopefully I will get to see a picture of it once it's out and prepped. This is just so cool.